mistakes in sorting objects. So children, in the previous video, we learned sorting different objects on the basis of their shape. In this video, we will see some common mistakes in sorting objects. Today, Choto's teacher has brought some objects to the class. Children, look, I have brought some objects with me. Can you identify them? The teacher shows an object and asks, Children, can you identify that which shape this object resembles? Teacher, this is a round ball-like shape. Well done, Aarti. You are right. This has a round ball-like shape. The teacher now showed another item and asked, Children, what does this object look like? Teacher, this has a box-like shape. Well done, Chotu. Well said. This has a box-like shape. Children, now can you recognize the shape of this object? Teacher, it looks like a cylinder. Very good, Aarti. Well said. This has a cylinder-like shape. Teacher, this has ice cream cone-like shape. Very well, Chotu. Well said. This has a cone-like shape. And children, here we have a shape that looks like a cylinder. But Chotu did not understand the difference between these two figures. Teacher, but both these shapes look alike. Chotu, why do you think these two shapes are the same? Teacher, see this. This shape's base is round and other shape also has a round base. Chotu, you are right. Both of these shapes are round at the bottom. But if we look at both these figures from above, the cylinder-like shape is round from the top and the cone-like shape is pointed from the top. Oh, is it so? Come on, let us identify the cylinder-like shape and the cone-like shape out of these two objects. Children, can you identify the shape of these objects? Teacher, its shape is like that of a cylinder. Well done, Pinky. It is like a cylinder. Teacher, its shape is like a cone. Well done, Chotu. It has a cone-like shape. Children, was your answer the same? So, as you have seen, the cylinder-like shape is round on both sides, but the cone-like shape is round on one side and pointed on the other side. So that was all for today. In this video, we all saw the common mistakes in sorting objects. I hope you have understood this topic properly. Bye children!